Mm -hmm. Welcome back. We're looking pretty decent out there this morning. Look at this. We're starting to get some sunshine going here just a little after 6 o'clock. So that's kind of nice. We're adding daylight each and every day up until the summer solstice. Although we still have snow on the ground. I'll move over to the other side of the camera because you might notice this right there. Pretty much a shiny thing, right? So we're going to be seeing uh, plows out doing what they need to do today to get the roads in decent shape. After we saw this yesterday over in Monaco, 7.3 inches of snow. Same with our Revita. 8 inches over in Lac de Flambeau. And Rylander, not as much. Just about 3.8 inches of snow and that's about all some of that fell asleep as well so we had sleet and snow falling in Rhinelander throughout the day yesterday we have winter weather advisories posted again no for these counties highlighted here until about 6 p.m wednesday they kick in later on tonight because we're going to be watching out for some more snowfall that will be on the way with another system that will be on the way as well but otherwise here we are so we have this system moving away from us now so we're pretty much done with this we can say see you later we're going to be watching for the next one it's starting to kind of touch minnesota now we'll zoom things out and give you the bigger picture that's kind of what it looks like right about in there we're going to be tracking this off toward the east kind of riding along this cold front and we'll get it moving in tonight lasting through tomorrow as well some spots can see up to two to four inches of snow before we're all finished up especially further off towards the north and also to the west so it's time, let's break all this down with future casts right now so the clouds break up today so that means sunshine keep those sunglasses handy you saw the monaco sky cam no clouds to be seen at this point though so it does mean a lot of sunshine to be expected today more clouds on the way later on tonight we get to welcome in some snow by early Wednesday morning. There'll be a break, but then by about 10 o'clock in the morning, another wave moves through. That's out of here by around 2 to 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Maybe some gusty winds as well as the isobars there, those black lines there. Could be a little bit stacked from time to time too, but those will back off later on Wednesday night into Thursday morning. And maybe some breaks in the clouds as well to start things off for your Thursday. Nothing ridiculous with the snow, especially in the parts of Price, Vilas County areas to the north and west. Maybe up to 3 to 4 inches of snow before we're finished up there. Further down to the south, Highway 8 areas to the south, 1 to 2, maybe up to 3 inches. And further down to the south, like south of Marathon County, maybe an inch or less before this system begins to taper off. So temperatures right now, they're cool out there, 20 degrees in Rhinelander, middle 20s in Lando Lakes and Eagle River. Warmer to the south, though, upper 20s in Wausau and Mosinee, and lower 30s in Stevens Point, upper 20s in Wisconsin Rapids. And it feels cooler out there. Look at this, 9 degrees for the feels like temperature in Rhinelander because the winds are a little gusty out there this morning. And some spots are reaching up to around 10 to 15 miles per hour at times as well as this is pretty much a west wind at least at this point but your forecast for today 38 degrees partly cloudy out there we'll see more sunshine than anything else that southwest wind getting up to five to ten miles per hour by tonight here we are 24 degrees snow showers moving in late the east wind getting up to about five to ten miles per hour Northwoods Furniture and Mattress, seven-day forecast. There's the snow for your Wednesday. Well, it backs off later on Wednesday night, Thursday through Sunday. Looking pretty good. Mixture of clouds and sun. Temperatures warming up to the 30s by the weekend. More snow by Monday as temperatures remain in the mid-30s.